So what? Where'd you guys leave off? We were at UCLA, right? Um, you guys are at UCLA. Freddy has disappeared. <laughs> Alrighty then. So Freddy has a specific um place he needs to go to. Mm-hmm. Terrifying. Uh, Absolutely terrified right now. Yeah, Jack's oh, gonna head back to his old dorm room and gather up his stuff. Um, it's a lot harder to do this while on my phone and roll twenty won't load. So, um, I will note as you guys pull up to the college, there is a like a higher police activity. You guys realize. Sort of circling the campus. Isn't it All crazy right. that I never had my face seen on campus? <laughs> Wait, how did we get to UCLA? Because you guys drove. drove. Oh, we that's still, right. Because I stole that car. Yeah, we yeah. drove the car that you stole. So, Jack's gonna look over to Jeremiah and just essentially be like. You wait here, protect the car, and I'm gonna be right back, okay? And he's just gonna try to stealthily get back into his dorm by running faster than he can. Okay. Speak. Uh, nothing. Uh, give me a speed check. FCR. To get past multiple uh roaming security, uh, police. Give me a CR. Sexual speed. All right. <clears throat> uh, dexterity three. All right. So and, CR three. Uh, specialized in running. Well, are you trying to just run back there, like faster than yeah. anyone can notice you, or are you just trying yeah. to actually sneak? Super speed. That's what I was. Okay. Would that up the CR. I'm taking it. It would up the CR. I want to up the CR. It's just that no one's going to notice you. People are going to notice your red blur. <laughs> oh, okay. Well, that's, that's okay. I'll try to be fast. <laughs> yeah, this is... You're now rolling. Instead of being stealthy, you're just rolling to be fast enough that they can't see you. Exactly. So, is it still CR6? If it's still CR6. But you can now apply right. your running. So, dexterity three, specialized in running, three. and using. So, yeah, one. Power. All right. Um. So nice. it's free. All right. Um. So you guys see. All right. You see Jack tiptoe out of the truck and just go. All right. I'll be right back. <laughs> And you see a red blur just start cutting in between the cop cars. And the cop, you see the cops look around bewildered. It's like grabbing their walkie talkies. <laughs> and what are you grabbing while you're inside of your room? I'm essentially just grabbing my clothes and like just a couple of my belongings because that's really only I have. Also, there. give me an intellect check. CR4. CR4? Uh, okay. Like, is this to see if I don't hit anything or? No, this is this is more of a perception thing. Let's see oh, if you okay. notice something while you're running. <laughs> Oof. Bowl is wrong. CR is a four. four. I feel like anytime oh, okay. I do that, I always roll like the number of the CR rather than what I'm supposed to. Mm -hmm. Um, but yeah, so you don't notice anything, and you make it back inside of your room. So I just gather my pocket knife, my matches. My um, picks and as you're picks gathering well. things, you hear it. Oh, what the hell? What was that? I don't know. Open the door. Uh, I'm gonna try to. Can I hear this in time and react enough to like try to hide myself? Uh, give me a speed check. Uh, this one's CR5. Let's just CR5. Dexterity 3. All right. F Effort one. All right. Is this a defense or is this a, just a straight roll? 
I'll say it's defense. All right, because I'm trained in speed defense without armor. I'm not wearing armor. All right, so out of the seat. Um, you dash into the bed as quick as you can. Um, as the two, uh, the two police officers that were standing guard at your door that you failed to notice enter your room. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Who saw the door? Not really. They didn't really see the door. They felt the door open and close at super speeds. <laughs> well then. <laughs> oh boy. So, you see and hear the footsteps of the police officers as they walk around the room. You know. Didn't they, didn't they say that there's some weird of these criminals? But I heard some of them can like blow up entire town. You're just, you're just saying things. Like, friends. I, I know what I heard. Like, I don't see anything, so go back out. Like, all right. <laughs> all right. Can I see if they close the door? Um, hear you hear the door close as they leave. All right, so I'm just going to roll out and start recollecting my stuff. All right. <laughs> you collect all your stuff without problem. What's everyone else doing while this is happening? Freddy is not there. <laughs> Freddy went <laughs> to the um, parking lot to get his motorcycle. Because he Charles has going places with to you? go. No, okay. Charles. Charles is not with me. Charles. Charles. I told Charles to stay with Jeremiah. <laughs> yeah. And I think we all went to UCLA with Jack. Yeah. So, Freddy just basically gets out of the car and looks at Charles and Jeremiah and is like, Stay here. I won't be back. I'll see you guys later. And then just walks away. He <laughs> walks towards the parking lot. Alright. Um, okay. And you just walk off. <laughs> <coughs> um, you drive... To the Italian restaurant that you were instructed to. Okay, I did go back to um, my apartment just to get my more post-looking clothes. Makes sense. <laughs> just, just so you know. <laughs> just get the scorch marks out of the clothing, right. you know. So, you get to the Italian restaurant, and you see it's Vinny's Italian cuisine um, down at Venice Beach. Um, you open the door into it, still wearing your um, motorcycle helmet and your biker outfit. And you see, um, you've been in this place once or twice. <laughs> um, sometimes the boxes need their own fix. Um, you don't think you've ever seen as many important people in the crime industry in one place ever. As nice. there's about 20 of them, all inside of their own little section around the back of the store. Nice. Some of them you don't even know, but if they're hanging around these guys, they have to be bad. And they all seem to be um, intensely discussing. And sitting sort of in the middle of them, not saying a word, just sort of sternly listening. And given pretty much a 10-foot gap by anyone sitting beside him, is the boss. Um, you you know him, his name, as Mikkov Ruskowski. Um, he's also known as The Hammer. <laughs> okay, I'm just going to write down The Hammer because I don't know how to spell his name. Yeah, most people <laughs> do not. <laughs> Am I K H O V? O twenty? Loading? Give me Nani. What? What? Oh, Brandon. JJ. So yes. I had an idea. Currently, <laughs> us um us villains don't really have a fully set up base. Mm -mm. But if we all put in one XP we could have a fully set up base. 
All right, I have exactly one XP. I also have exactly one XP. Brandon also has exactly one XP. I hope. <laughs> Please, Brandon. <laughs> I know for a fact he does. Dude, Kitty, why are you laying on my stuff? Ooh. Well, answer the fucking question then, Brandon. <laughs> Do you, would you have one XP Do that you'd put in have... for us, uh, for the villains to have an actual base? Wait, so do we all have to, like, split this? Yeah, um, that's what we're doing. Yeah, because none of us have 3 XP just to make the base ourselves. So what I was thinking, so if we all pool our XP together, we'll have 3 XP to make a base. That would work. Right. Oh, I hi. thought we kind of over you. <laughs> oh, hello oh. there. <laughs> hello there. I mean, I thought we kind of already had, like, that little yeah, place for one. Yeah, that's, that's what you see, but you... It's... Really not secure Dude. though is the thing. Like, uh, yeah, like the we agents got, already, yeah. like the agents know that we were there, and they swatted it and quote unquote killed Andre. <laughs> <laughs> Nobody knows that other than Jeremiah. <laughs> <laughs> Jeremiah hasn't told anyone else. It's on a need to know basis. Yeah, meaning everyone needs to know. No, no. Nah. I'm pretty sure I can recreate Andre's character sheet on Roll Tony because he was only uh, I think he only had two advancements, so Am I the first of us to actually tier remember. up to tier two? Yes. Holy I just need shit, that's magic. never happened. <laughs> yeah, because my character <laughs> went supernova and thought to be dead, so I had to start from scratch. Your character kinda of fucking died. <laughs> yeah. yeah. I kind of give all these people guys. Okay, so right. are we are we pulling together to make a base, but with yes. one XP each? How about we say before we split up, we make coordinates to go up at our new base that we found. Okay. Before which happens early... to be yeah. which happens underwater to... facility. No. It's the underwater <laughs> no. facility. <laughs> no, we can't. The underwater have... facility no, happens the... to be right here off Venice. No, 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 not an underwater facility. <laughs> We need something else. We need to be more unique than this. <laughs> also because it, also because yeah, we we can villains wouldn't stay in an underwater base. We'd stay in a penthouse, exactly. <gasps> they would Wait, be Wait, yeah. Oh, hold on. I'm trying to think. They'd be in a research facility up in the mountains. No, that's too far away from our base. That's that's too far away. It takes us hours to get to any bad place, and then by the time we get there, it'll be any sorry. bad. <laughs> what if we set up our villain base right across the street from the LA Police Department? <laughs> Hide in plain sight. I love yeah. it. We wave at Tiffany all the time, and she just she's just like so angry because she can't prove that we're actually a villain, <laughs> and she's just like, I know that they're villains. <laughs> Right across from the police. She the, could prove that uh, Jack is, because she's seen Jack's. Jack just won't leave the base anymore. <laughs> then again, if I use a costume, then she won't know for sure. Ha ha. <laughs> right. In our base, so, must be. Where do we? Are we in agreement base? though? Like a penthouse type thing. A tall skyscraper that goes above the clouds. Okay, fucking Olivia Queso. No. <laughs> Who? This is gonna be like Lex Corp. Or oh, it's gonna. What about the uh, Tony Stark type okay. thing? What if it's like that? It has a V on the side, and we're just like it. It means very nice, yeah. not villain. Yes. Yes, of course. We have a villain. Or we could just do like um Doofenshmirtz and just have it go su uh, super villain evil incorporated. <laughs> yeah. All right. No, see one coming. Let's get back into the session, please. <laughs> <laughs> we'll discuss see, where see, we we'll discuss it in chat because I feel like <laughs> that might be. Yeah. See one ping. This is this is right, where wait, it is. What, what? the observatory. Oh, I see. see oh it? shit! Yeah, cool. top right. Okay. Uh, the observatory in L.A. Yeah. That's way too far away. Super it secret. It is super secret. It's both pretty far, but it's also super secret. Man, I'd love if I could see where you guys are pointing. Um, in the top right, right of the top. map, it says Mount Wilson Observatory. Uh, I I totally memorized my maps. <laughs> I'm sorry. 
<laughs> you're trying you're to be fine. helpful. You're fine. <laughs> I know it's fine. I'm just trying to be helpful, um, man. Actually, a good place that is actually quite famous in LA that you guys may want to take uh, take over uh, the Griffith Observatory. Um, it's closer to more downtown, and it's still an observatory on top of a mountain. <laughs> it's in Griffith Park, the Griffith Park Observatory. Where is that? It's like where on the map. <laughs> I would tell you if I saw the map. <laughs> oh, I found it. Griffith Park, up here. Griffith Park. Yeah, I didn't say Griffith. I said Griffith. Oh, oh Griffith. G R I F F. Yeah, it's actually not far away yeah. at all from yeah, the no. city. So do we want our it's base? Pretty... Sure. Why not? Because if you guys want the observatory vibe, and you guys could say like, I'm, you either. Because it is also a tourist attraction, so you could either say that you just take it over, <laughs> um, or that you find a spot under Griffith Park. Let's do we take want an it under over. Do we want an underground facility? I feel like we're already going with that in the hero type. True. So, do we just want to take over? Why don't we just take it over? Yes, dude. That would be great for publicity. I feel like the whole point of this base is to not have the public know where it is, though. The so mansion up terrify there? them. Everyone think they're on a bad trip. Don't go there. Mansion? No, that's that's the San Fernando mission, not mansion. He says mission. Oh, oh, oh. I can see map. Nice. Oh my god. Or we can stay inside a blimp. No. <laughs> we're gonna... Eyes in the sky, surveil around the yes. city. Yes, we're just gonna have Jack you can, our base out of the sky. If you're just gonna, if you're just gonna take places, you can always just take the Playboy Mansion. Or oh, we could have. My God. <laughs> you don't Atlas's know how much ship. fun Freddy would have in a Playboy Mansion. Like. <laughs> I, I think that's the strat, honestly. I honestly think that's the strat. Where, where is the Playboy All Mansion? Of... Out of curiosity. Towards the center, it's by a golf course. Oh, oh okay, yeah. That, is that it? Is it like right here? Yeah. It's probably on this map somewhere. <laughs> somewhere. We're trying. Somewhere. We're, painting, <laughs> we're painting the location we think it's at. <laughs> I know. I see you pinging it, but I don't think it's there. Oh, okay. Um, I think it's like right here. Oh, this. Yeah, hey, that hey. giant hey. building. <laughs> West, yeah. Yeah. I'll, I'll put in one XP for this. Same. Sure. Okay. It's settled How, after. All right, what do, you, what do you guys do? Because if you want a secret base, <laughs> um, what the sacking and taking over the um, <laughs> Playboy Mansion is not secret. Yeah, that's what I was saying. Like, I don't. I want a secret base. Okay. <laughs> Freddy would feel a lot more comfortable. The observatory would probably actually. Be best off. I can't. I can think of a way, if you guys spend XP, I can think of a way that you guys take it secret. If you want the, okay, for all the above ground part of the mansion. Yes. Yeah, then, yeah I can think of a way that you guys can take it. Oh, yeah. Or, an underground... It will require me taking control system. of one of your characters, but it'll be fine. Because it's in your guys' face. Alright. Okay. Wait, whose character so, are you so taking over? You. Uh, oh. So. Oh. oh. <laughs> because your powers will be specific for this. Okay. I'm going to a... place a marker here so that we know that this is where the villain base is. I have a question. Oh, I can move the marker I already made. Oh, okay. I will delete this. Uh, Giant Duncan, blue I have a question. Yes? While I'm in the room, can I try to start assembling... The uh, suit that Jack has here. As my Since your suit is a cosmetic suit, you can make it whenever you want. <laughs> okay, so as I'm ca collecting my stuff, can I just start creating it there? And yeah. Put it on? Okay. With cosmetic stuff, stuff that has no really, like, thing, I'm fine with you guys, like, insta-making it or just saying that you found it and stuff like that. Because right, I don't want to go, like, Oh, you don't have enough resources to make your costume. Guess you're gonna guess you're gonna be exposed. Not. Nah. <laughs> yeah, because under my equipment, I have sweatsuit, aka my outfit. So. Yeah. 
gonna put that on, and I might knock out a couple people. <laughs> Who knows? Got a couple people. All right, so moving so back handcuffs. to Joker. <laughs> Joker. Joker's not, Joker. not here. <laughs> Moving back to Joker inside of the Mafia base. So, <laughs> I see Julius. <laughs> <laughs> no, she she did. Did. Do you want to notice our bases are perfectly aligned? Hi, Freddy, what are you doing? Um, I guess walking up near ish to the mob Ooh. boss. Like, I'm gonna give him like the t like the space that everyone else seems to be giving him as well. But I'm just gonna mm. walk up to him and kind of arms behind, uh, arms behind my back. He looks over and goes, Post. Post, post, my boy. Come here. Come here. I have something to tell you. I've been given permission to walk forward, so I'm going to do that. <laughs> he goes, he goes, Post. I'm having a very bad day. And you'd say the second he started talking, everyone else stopped. <laughs> uh, and these guys are also. It's very important. I, as a player, am intimidated. Post is not. <laughs> Post, my friend, my my buddy. I have had a very bad day. Do you, do you have any recommendations on calming down? Um. Yoga. Honestly, when I want to calm down, I usually just take a few breaths, and I picture myself in a happy place. Which... Oh. Alright, let me, let me try that. You see him deep breathe in, it's like, I'm in my happy place. My happy place is me with all of my fucking stuff back. And he just slams the table. And he like, he goes wide-eyed and stares at everyone. Just oh, yeah. glare. He's like, now why has no one fucking gave anything progressive to get my stuff back? Huh? Why do I not have the head of the person who blew up my money and my casino? Somewhere. He just, <laughs> Jack's just vibing. <laughs> ja Jack's just vibing, Freddy, and then Post is just here, fully, a full straight face. I, as a player, am laughing so hard. <laughs> <laughs> he just like, looks around and like, huh? Hey. Hey, what? Hey, hey, post, post, I thank you. I thank you. Excellent advice. I have uh, realized what I wanted. So if one of these fuckwits can deliver it to me, maybe I can relive my happy place. Post is just gonna give like an awkward kind of nod. <laughs> he's not, uh, this is Post actually being confused where he's like, is this a good thing? Was this a bad thing? So he's just gonna kind of give a nod. Post. It's the reason why I called you. I need you. I need you and your expertise because I am so fucking short, man. And because all of these fucking imbeciles can't do anything. Else. So I need someone who's not even a part of you. To go, get my ship, bring it here. I need every bit of firepower I've ever ordered. Matter of fact, where, where's that kid? The weird one. Zero. Um. <laughs> ah. uh -oh. <laughs> I as a player am um, panicking. <laughs> push to the front by bodyguards bigger than pretty much anyone you've ever seen before. <laughs> um, is the kind of scrawny, uh, still rather tall, but kind of scrawny frame of Zero, um, who you all remember from the Hero campaign. Um. And you guys, any, you see the boss, the zero. How many fucking firearms can you give me today? Uh, zero goes, well, there's a lot of things. No, shut the fuck up. Give me number. I want bullets. I want explosives. I want a goddamn nuke if you can get it. Right away, if you got the money, I got the stuff. Um... <laughs> like, Poor choice of words. Post? Post? Yes. You are going to ship everything I buy from him to me tonight. You have nothing else on your plate. You have another order, I will kill them personally. 
you are the only, this is the only thing you are doing. Ring, ring. <laughs> my phones are always on silent when I'm when I'm like in the presence of the mafia. So even if my phone would ring, like I wouldn't hear. <laughs> Jack's just gonna be like, "Yeah, dude, I don't know what you're doing, but uh, some cops are by my room. You know, uh, I'm just gonna have some fun." And be right back. <laughs> um, Freddie, Post is just gonna kind of nod his head and say, "Yes, sir." Um, are we all understanding? Perfect. Leave. And after a few seconds of like awkward silence, the group that is around him slowly begins to murmur again. I guess I'm gonna walk up to Zero because he's the person I'm delivering these items from. He did he tell me where I'm delivering these items to? No. Uh, something you realize from working with the mob boss. He doesn't really give instructions. He just tells you to do something, and you better do it how he wants, or you're probably going to end up dead. <laughs> oh, dear. Okay. That's why Question. not a lot of people are usually around him. <laughs> okay. I've made it this long. It's been going on 15 years. I've made it this long. <laughs> also, well, most of the time, you don't deal with him. You deal with everyone. I do. You usually don't deal with super high-ups. <laughs> Have I ever ha I'm assuming I've made at least like one delivery for him, right? Yeah. Sometimes like one time you he gave you a letter personally to give to his grandmother at a time where he thought a snitch was in um like a rat was in his game uh, and he didn't want anyone to know the location of right. his grandmother. He didn't want her life to be in danger. Um Question. How long and was this? <laughs> Out of curiosity. Like two. <laughs> two months. <laughs> oh, two months ago? Okay. Yes. Um, and that's pretty much the only delivery you do then specifically for him. Because okay. I was going to ask what I know from previous experience where I should deliver this stuff to. But I'm assuming he doesn't want this delivered to his grandmother's house. No. Um, to your best knowledge, you probably think he wants this to go to, like, one of his goons' warehouses to start arming up. I guess I'm going to ask Zero for professional advice. <laughs> so, so you so. go up to Zero. Zero's just sort of inside the, like, back of the room sort of scratching his head. Like, he looks confused. <laughs> Just gonna kind of walk up to zero and wait, or like, just not really say anything, just kind of stand there for a minute. What? Uh, so, um, so I guess you're gonna be doing the delivery, right? Yes. All right, well, there's a van out back. I guess I gotta fucking load all my firearms in. Do you know which warehouse I'm taking it to? I don't assume any. Then one, one way or another, it's gonna Close get to him. So. Close is gonna nod his head. And as that's happening, um, we're gonna move back to the gang uh, at UCLA. So, <laughs> how do you plan on leaving? <laughs> hey, so. I had a thing that I kind of wanted to do to see if it would look pretty cool while I'm doing it. But, you know, also, like, for question, example... Real quick, where did you leave the car? <laughs> I'm pretty sure we left it, like, just, like, a maybe a block or so away from the... Okay. Maybe a little bit less, I don't know. Just, like, I mean, like literally in the park. Like, did you park it at a parking lot? Just on the side of the road? Probably, like, in a parking space, like a block away. All right. So, what I was thinking about doing is sneak attack, knocking out the two guards by my door. All right. You can give it a roll. All right. So, what's the CR? Why? Hey, Don. I don't know. Kind of shook, but let's just keep going. Buddy, friend, pal. 
Oh, and don't worry about way, it. So, by the way, Jack uh, is in his suit now. Okay. Um, to do this, you're gonna have to give me two rolls. The first one, <laughs> yeah. yourself. Uh, so give me a speed roll. CR hey, six. CR six. Okay. Uh, Dex three. F All right. All right. <laughs> And would using my power work for this? Are we trying to take them out super fast? Yes. Alright, so, yep. So, and would hand to hand combat work for this? Very much, yes. Okay. So... Wait, no, keep you keep that out for now. Okay. So, then this is the first. Dex, dex three, then effort, mm-hmm. that's four. And then mm-hmm. using my power, I am trained in, so it's five. So, it's the other one. Five. So three or higher. Right. Yeah, um, you're easily able to do this uh, stealthily. Um, now, give me a might check of CR4 to see if you're able to knock them out. Okay. Uh, hand-to-hand combat trained in and strength three. Or two, sorry. All right, so you have strength CR4. two, so that goes by the two. And then uh, here's where hand to hand can come in. All right, so CR one, right? All right, yes. Ooh, you're cutting it close there, JJ. Yeah, that's what I was saying. <laughs> but a pass is a pass. As both the guards go down quickly and quickly. I am going to steal their handcuffs and their gun. Very easy to put off their unconscious bodies. And then on our way back to the car. This time I'm gonna to try to be stealth instead of just super speeding by. Alright, so stealthing it there is going to take longer than just running like super quick. I then I guess I'll try super speeding it again. Okay. It was just going to be, um, if you stealth there, it was just going to be three stealth rolls. If you super speed, it's just one roll. Alright, so I'll just do the one speed roll. Alright. Uh, CR, six, speed check. Dex, three, effort, specialized in running. Actually, CR, seven, because since you run through before, they're now cautious because they saw a red one. Okay, so Dex, three, Effort, so that's four, bring it down. Specialized in running, that's CR, bring it down by six, and then using my power for speed. Then... So is that three? <laughs> yes. All right. Um, you just book it back to, um, well, you book it back, back to where I was going to cut to, the car, as... Jeremiah and Charles are just chilling in there. So what are you guys doing as this is a bit of a rewind. We're back when Jack was gathering his stuff. What are you guys doing? Well, Jeremiah, what are you doing? Well, I'm going to probably be sitting in the uh, passenger seat and kind of like... Um, a perfect response. Or what, do you, what do you call it? Is it like twiddling the, the fingers? Like, you know, you, you like your uh, yeah, doing that. Mm-hmm. And so then they're just he, sitting there in awkward silence. And he looks up when a police car strolls up behind them. The car is off inside of a parked spot. They're talking about your car, of course. And a uh, cop car's lights aren't on. Just pulls up slowly behind the car, and the police officer like in the stop right behind the car. Oh no! They found the stolen car. I'm sure it's fine. Uh, Charles, don't. The uh, a flashlight shoots out from the window of the cop car at the back <laughs> of the the car that they're in. Um. Specifically at the license plate. Wait, so are they shining the light behind our car? Where is Brandon? Hello? Brandon's here. 
Oh, I don't hear him talking. Oh, can you not hear me? I can hear him talking. Oh, I haven't been able to hear him talk. Oh, he's been responding. <laughs> yeah, I legit just thought he wasn't responding. No, <laughs> he's been responding. That's why I said he's just twiddling oh, yeah. his thumbs. Oh, now I can hear Brandon. Sweet that. epic gamer win. So what is Jeremiah doing? <laughs> the police pull up behind. Okay, him, like, so is it, did the cop car like pull up behind us, and he like has a light behind, uh, shining in? Yeah, the passenger. It seems like there's now two cops inside this car, as the one in the passenger seat is shining on um, the license plate. Uh, Charles, stay calm. Mm. Just act like you're on your phone or something. You know, college kids. <laughs> oh, we don't know this is a um, stolen car. <laughs> yeah. J Jack's the only yeah, person who uh, knows it's a stolen car. <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> yeah. There's a reason oh. why they stopped. <laughs> oh, fuck. Um, the police, the two police get out of the car and start to move towards the passenger and driver's side. Uh, That's going to be interesting. Charles and Siphon, they're bound. I rolled down the window. Mm-hmm. Um, wait, so does, does the cop approach me yet? Uh, no, they're going up. I was giving you time to do <laughs> if you want to do anything. Oh, the car is off, <laughs> by the way. Does it look like there's any kind of, uh, sharp objects in this vehicle? Um, the keys is probably the sharpest object in this vehicle. Uh, are, are there any, like, um, maybe tools inside the vehicle? Like, you know, like, the, the tire, those tire things you use and then screw the nuts in the tires? The tire areas? Those are usually yeah, in the trunk of the vehicle. You give a quick cursory glance, and it is not inside of this part of the vehicle. <laughs> I flip down the, um... What's that? The the, th the mirror above, like the uh, the windshield, you know, that's using from the passenger seat. Yes. And I can look. I just, you know, I glare up and look back. Um, the officers move to the windows <laughs> and shine the light into the windows. <laughs> and the one on the driver's side taps on the window. I motion him to come around to my side. He is on your side. Oh, I thought he was on the you driver's said, side. You said There's the driver's one side. one on each side. Yeah. Okay, so I rolled down and the I window. Thought... All right. Uh, and it's now proved that this car is a manual crank window since the car is off. <laughs> Good afternoon, officer. Is there a problem? You do know you're uh, shooting inside of a registered stolen vehicle, right? This vehicle is registered stolen? Please step yeah. outside of the car. Hey, hey. Sure, <laughs> I'm just waiting for my friend. My friend just stops by to get his things, but you know. Um, can you step outside of the car? Sure. Um. Oh man, I'm gonna miss you Uh, and they do the same on Charles' side, getting Charles outside of the car. And Jack, I say this is probably where you run back. <laughs> All right, can I see them like stepping out with the police? Am I close enough to see that? Yes. No. So Jack's just gonna mur murmur to himself like, yeah. And he's <laughs> going to, like, he's gonna truck the officers, like, or at least one of them. The one on Brandon's side, he's just gonna, like, lower his shoulder and just, just annihilate him with, like, the bam. speed. <laughs> the speed, the, the speed. Give me a mic check. CR4. Can I, can I be assist? Assistance? This... Um, this you don't even know that this is about to happen, so... This is going... Does this count as a hand-to-hand? -hand? Yes, that's very much does. Okay, so... CR1, because I have two strength. Alright. Sorry, I think popped up. I got a 15. Alright, there we go. Um... Yeah. You... Slam into this officer, knocking him into the side of the car, and he hits and is out as his head like bounces off the hood of the car. 
Um, the other officer quickly pulls out his gun. <laughs> can I do something? Can I see like before he can before he like goes to aim it? Can I roll to like get over there and like spin it out of his hands to point it at him? Give me a speed check. CR eight. All right. So Dex three. Speed, one, F for effort. I mean, so that's four. Yeah. Will this count as running? Because I'm running over to him. Yes. All right. So specialize in running. That brings it down two more. So it brings it down six. Then using my power. And will this count as a defense or no? No. Okay. So CR one. All right. <laughs> Jesus Christ. No. Oh, oh my no. God. Oh God, no. Damn it, we don't even have XP. Anytime I try to do something cool with Jack. <laughs> That's a yikes. I trip. <laughs> Freddy's night seems to be going a lot better than your night. Like, I figured Freddy was going to have a rough night, but like, <laughs> it seems nope. to be going pretty well. <laughs> so can I... I put my hands up, right? Or does he take it down? I don't even think I need to, needed to roll for that, because I could use an action to move 200 feet. I wouldn't... Well, you're you're rolling to take the gun yeah, from his hand. I know. Oh. Okay, I thought I was just. Oh, damn it! I should have been more specific. Damn it! Yeah. Uh, Dante, so what's are you uh, re-rolling, or is are you sticking with the one? None of us have any XP. We use I gave you guys one. five XP. Yeah. I'm pretty sure we. I'm oh yeah, sure you guys just it to pulled it like, together. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah All right. Um. You sprint over and go to grab the gun. You make the not so smart decision to grab the gun barrel first, <laughs> so your hand covers where yeah. the bullet comes out of. Oh no. The sudden jerk and appearance of you. Obviously, causes the police officer to fire. <laughs> um, there is now a bullet-sized hole inside of your head. You take uh, take five damage. <laughs> can I make a might roll to see if I can like stop the bullet? <laughs> stop the bullet, Superman! Give me a CR ten might roll. <laughs> Damn, I don't even think I could. <laughs> oh my fucking god. You're not no, playing okay. as Torin. <laughs> yep. I thought I had another physical skill, so I was like, ah, maybe I can bring it down to a six. And I'm like, nope, uh, I could bring it down to a seven. But So so yeah. I quickly pick up the, the, off the, the other officer's gun. Um, okay. Sorry. You... Rip the officer's gun out of his unconscious hand. Um, the officer, the other officer, now has his gun trained on you. And um, you are both pointing gun and gun at each other. Not sure who's gonna shoot first. Oh, Jack shit. currently on the ground. I'm holding his bloody hand when a hand from seemingly nowhere grips onto the side of this officer's face and begins to scream. Oh, no. What the fuck? As Charles, who was there and everyone just forgot about, <laughs> uh, grabs onto this officer's face and begins draining the life out of him. Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> you watch this officer, who is probably in his young 20s, begin to age and almost decay as the space takes on a skeletal form oh oh, oh. and black energy seems to seep from his face into Charles's hand. That is so cool. Oh, oh, oh my god. My god. god. Um, after like about 10 seconds of this, the cop drops dead in a skeletal like Almost like if they brought up mummified bones from thousands of years ago. Okay. Well then, is the other officer still alive? Yes, I just knocked him up. He, and Charles just sort of looks, 
shocked at what he just did. Is it? Uh, oh, oh God. <laughs> Charles, nice job, me, you, you bastard. bastard. <laughs> you bastard. <laughs> Good check, um, you okay? Not really. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, the pain oh. of taking a bullet through the hand is definitely coursing through your body right now. <laughs> so I'm going to pick up Jack and put him in the back of the car. I'm fine. I'm not down, but shit, this hurts. <laughs> and then I'm going to... Charles, <laughs> do you have anything that could, like, I don't know, like a first aid kit on you by any chance? Um... If you give me like a minute, I could like uh, uh use one of these officers' shirts. I don't. I killed that guy. Uh, I'm sure he's fine. Let's go drive, please. <laughs> I'm sure um, he's fine. It's Charles. Uh, Charles takes one of the mummified officers' shirt and get brings you inside of the car, uh, and. Jeremiah, I assume you drive. <laughs> yeah. Because so what I'm gonna do is get the keys in ignition. I'm gonna back up and then run over the knocked out police oh, officer. Oh my fucking god! <laughs> Very unnecessary. But as you guys start to drive, you hear boom, 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 boom. <laughs> Jack just kind of kind of look over to uh, <laughs> the like, I'm pretty sure he's fine too. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just gonna smirk. I'm just gonna give off a smirk. So, if you use your 10 minute recovery rule now, Charles will bandage you up. Okay. I, I would like to make a point here. Something funny that I've noticed. We're much better at being villains than we are being at being heroes. Because it is very easy to be a villain. <laughs> but we're a lot <laughs> better at it. Role, then. Since <laughs> I used my 10 minute one, can I use the recovery rule? Yeah, you get a d6 for that. Okay. Alright. <coughs> right. This is fun. <laughs> so, I'm gonna say to Jack while we're on our way, like, what the fuck? You didn't say this was stolen? Uh, yeah, um, Charles very poorly bends you up. Uh, barely numbs the pain, but it's something. <laughs> it's stopping the bleeding. As, as you notice, Jack's, as Charles doing this, his eyes are just glowing, like, complete red at this point. Like, Normally, when you try to see him, like, run off that trail, that's just, his eyes are just completely yeah. red. Um, but yeah, well, how do you respond to Jeremiah? <laughs> so, uh, well, I mean, I never had this car on my person. I had a truck. I came driving this thing, badly injured. Why did you think this was not stolen? I don't know, maybe to make something, you know, to see the cops and get on our ass. Dude, whatever, just... <clears throat> see if we can meet up with Freddy somewhere. Alright, I'll take us back to the base, and then we'll contact them. Now, taking the base, right? Freddy. Hi. <laughs> I think he's me controlling you. Oh. 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 oh, this is happening um, now. You're okay. driving. You're driving by, you're doing the deliveries inside the van with zero in the passenger seat. When you're passing the Playboy Mansion, you've passed it about three or four times. Um, and you're like, I make a pretty fucking cool base. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that would be um, something Freddy says. Um, you know, like, fuck it. I'm taking that. That's our base. You pull over. Tell, tell Zero to fucking wait here <laughs> um, as post and, and just walk in. Um, at first, there's a guard that tells you to stop. Um, after about two seconds of eye contact, he's running away screaming. <laughs> um, secondly, there is a couple of women that wonder why you're here. After uh, after telling them about your uh, porn biography Sorry, that does not exist, um, they are quite um, convinced of you say that you are who you're not. <laughs> we are male strippers. Um, 
and then you're able to get to the owner of the house. And after about a minute <laughs> alone with him, he has been, he's willing, let's say, to hand you over the deed to the Playboy Mansion. <laughs> <laughs> After a minute alone with you in a dark room, she was willing to give anything. <laughs> well, I didn't even use my powers. I just flirted with him the whole time. <laughs> well, let's say uh, it wasn't really much flirting. He more, um, let's just say he would rather take death than being a minute alone with you again, for uh. you were that terrified. <laughs> Oh, well, I'm a little hurt by that, but you know what? I have a Playboy Mansion now, <laughs> so <laughs> it's fine. Let's just so say... yeah, you guys meanwhile. now own the Playboy Mansion. Hell Let's just say, that meanwhile, you yeah. call Jeremiah, and that's why he says that. All right, boom. Uh, Freddy would not... <laughs> Freddy actually wouldn't call you guys, because he's still working. So... <laughs> Plus, we don't I'll, say after, I'll say after probably about 10 or 20 minutes you've finished delivering all the weapons <laughs> oh okay so um you guys head back to the old base first right yep um so huh this should be interesting <laughs> when oh, no. you say that wait, that's not camping, a good thing <laughs> wait would camping supplies have a med kit in it or a first aid kit it would Probably. I probably have a med kit. All right, because I forgot one of my items was a camping kit. So can I have another recovery roll? Um, I'll say you can add two to your recovery roll if you use the camping kit. All right. All right. So I'm almost full health again. Let's go. Cat, please stop laying on my pencils. And she stole my pencils. That's great. <laughs> um, let me give this roll real quick. What roll? What? Oh, uh, yeah. Is that a good thing? Mm. It's good for you guys. Oh, that's oh, good for us. Okay. That's two out of three. What? <laughs> what type huh? of bullshit uh, is this? Thomas has never seen this bullshit <laughs> before. Yeah. <laughs> Thomas had never seen such bullshit before. <laughs> Jeez, so best go out of three, we got a minor effect from one. Done. Oh, ah, ah. That one. Ah. Well, okay. All right. Well, this one decides. It. It's a twelve good. All right. Yes, and I'll stick to my word this time, even though I really want the opposite. <laughs> I was gonna say something, but I think I'm going to not say it right now. So say it. Oh, I'll pass. Thank you. So wait, off. do I get an wait? Do I get an XP from that uh, GM intrusion? No, that, that, just was, a so, that was this just is a the critical fail. critical fail. Okay. I'll be honest. When I saw when um, Dante said that <sighs> Jeremiah and the police officer Hold were up. just pointing yeah. their guns at each other, I was just thinking of mm, what to say. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, so as you guys pull up into the base, yeah. you guys, I assume you guys just walk in. Yeah. Probably. Well, they probably do that. JJ had BRB, so. Alright. So, yeah, you guys just walk into the base to quickly patch up uh, Jack. I kind of wish. I really wish. Let me Let me do this. Oh no, here comes the rerolls. He's, he's gonna use a reroll on us. <laughs> no. I wish I planned better, is, is all I'm saying. But I didn't. Because I now I now want to pull back up the base map, but I don't have the base map saved. I'm now actually gonna save um, this map. And, uh,. Then redraw the base map. If this error will go away, so I can see it. Aw, my little soy boy killed somebody today. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Look at About that. About time. 
listen, he has to get his tra- he has to take off his training wheels at some point. Being a villain isn't always the easiest for everyone. Sometimes people have more eyes. Um, just- I've literally ran over a cop in the first ten minutes of the session. Well, I said some people have morales, and you're not some people. <laughs> Just throwing that out there. <laughs> you also Sound like a blue orphanage. Yeah, you also blew up a fucking orphanage and killed a nun. She would have died in the explosion anyways. Yeah, but you actually committing the act of murder is different than setting up the things that someone else commits the act of murder. You are just an accessory in that. And this you were the murderer. You were the murder weapon. Uh, maybe that was his intention. <laughs> Imagine being Freddy and not actually doing anything. <laughs> hey, Freddy's doing a lot. Freddy gets paid for this. Dante, how much money does Freddy get paid for this? Because he gets paid for um, these tasks. He probably got that, paid like $20,000. Oh shit, 20,000? Okay. The, the boss was mad and willing to throw any money he had left to fix his problem. Alright. Freddy now has $20,000, $146. All for having a... Uh... Wait, so did he pay to fund the person who blew up the bank? I'm dead, nope, I'm dead. he paid oh, for... Shit. For Post to transport all the weapons. So, Freddy kind of made bank on blowing up his casino. I could. A nice I goose could chase for my- so much right now. Oh my god. See, Freddy. Oh. When Freddy is with the Mafia, he's two different people. So, Freddy with the Mafia is respectful, quiet, and doesn't. and gives genuine responses to things. Freddy, when he's not around the Mafia, is Freddy. He's an asshole. <laughs> And the TikTok e-boy. Sure. <laughs> this is going to be really mean, and I say it in a joking manner, but I'm sure he gets more pussy than you do, so... Mm. By Jeremiah, or...? By you, Brandon. <laughs> By you. No. <laughs> Does anime count? It, no, anime doesn't fucking count. It's <laughs> real people. Maze on your right. Maze Freddy's on your right. pastime? He just happens to be she me, the most popular... E-Boy and TikTok. But secretly, he's part of the criminal underground myth with us. Sleeping Diva? Secretly, I'm a villain and also a, crim- a um, crime person. Yeah, that's the word. Crime person. A cr- I'm a crime person. <laughs> not a criminal, not a mafia member, a crime person. A villain. And a villain. I'm a crime person and a villain. I'm a villainous Jack, crime person. Why not, why not commit genocide? You guys are legit terrorists. <laughs> it's fine. You guys have committed bombings on U.S. soil. You guys are terrorists. <laughs> Villains. Oh, Freddy has a girlfriend. Huh. Since when? Since the first episode when he went to Burning Man with his girlfriend and his other friend. And then we abandoned them. They're probably dead. I didn't abandon them. I see. You know, I made sure my girlfriend got home safely, and then I told the guy that I was with that if anything happened to her, that I was going to track him down. Jody's gonna come back and look at chat and just see this. No context. <laughs> just erotic role play in chat. That sounds weird. Out of context, huh? <laughs> kind of regret saying that. <laughs> what did I miss? <laughs> Nothing. Nothing. <laughs> Alright, so, because I didn't continue, because oh, okay. the thing I was going to go into next, uh, required you. <laughs> oh, okay. Brandon also just said be right back. God. Because he's getting dinner. <laughs> it's not a Is Brandon back? Makes sense. Yes, actually. Okay. Alright. Welcome back so to the So we time. can finally move on. My hand is just full of food. So... You guys go back to the base. Get back inside to quickly try to bandage up our uh, Jack. And you guys are promptly met with um a rather large figure. Um, 
you guys see what looks it's almost like a robot but not there's not enough machine parts as you guys hear a voice you guys have been very busy haven't you oh no santa no it's king oh Wait. I can tell because Dante's doing a German accent. Oh. Fuck. Oh no. <laughs> this is fun. This is fine. Like what? <laughs> this is fine. <laughs> yeah. I've got the gun. <coughs> um, you you guys see the silhouette of King? As you guys figured out. I'm starting to like walk around you guys. I assume that you guys are frozen in place. Oh. Uh, you see Jack tense up as he starts like glowing more electricity from his body. Now, you guys holding off a grocery store. That's bad. Do you have a but we don't really care. You guys bombing oh. an orphanage? And the police department? Well, now we have to step in. Wait, an orphanage? <laughs> yes. That was a part of the plan. Jeremiah, did you know about this? I was just following orders. What? <laughs> you guys have been given a very strange and special gift. And you use it for this, for useless and unneeded death. And what's it to you? What's it to me? Well, it's to me that you stopped doing this. And who are you? I am Agent King. If you do not choose. To peacefully, I will have to restrain you. You have caused far too much damage. And how did you find us? As he's talking to Jeremiah, Jack is just going to kind of roll behind Jeremiah and try to go into stealth. <laughs> Give me a stealth check. Uh, CR8. Fucking oh, Jeremiah. <laughs> CR10. <10. sighs> Unfortunate, but nice. Yes, this is very unfortunate. <clears throat> so, dexterity, three. So, it's CR7. Seven. Uh, speed. He is thinking about it. These are specially trained agents. It's going to be nearly impossible to get away from you. I'm not trying to get away. I'm just trying to hide. <laughs> well, yeah. Like, <laughs> Hiding is getting away. <laughs> if you hide well enough, they can't find you. All right. So I have effort and three decks. That brings it down to CR6. Yep. And would using my power work for this? Oh. Um, technically, your power right now does not hide. <laughs> it can just get okay. you from place to place quickly. If I like try to super speed stealth with that, no, never mind. You said that I can't do that. All right. Uh... Yeah. As much so. Um, I will allow you to super speed stealth in long, in long distances, but okay. because technically there you're just running away out of sight. Right now you're in a closed space; they could just track where you went from your lightning. The what? The what? What? So can I use speed defense or no? Oh no. Okay. So I can bring it down by four. Okay. So sixteen or, or eighteen or higher. All right. Oh, again? Is that an Dude. Out one? Did you roll an out one? Yes. I don't see it in chat. Yeah, I was going to say it's not in chat for us. Yeah. Oh, what? Oh, my connection has been interrupted. I'll just refresh. Hold on. Aw. Uh, I think that, that technically we, doesn't count. If we don't, if I don't see it, I'll let you re-roll. <laughs> okay, let's go. Yay. I still don't see it, so yes. the roll never happened. So. Oh my god. god damn it. Again? <laughs> oh you... my fucking right. god. Well, 
I saw that one, so. <laughs> Dude, what are the odds, bro? You rolled two not ones back to back. This Unless that was just a server for lag. And then it finally appeared. Which could be the case, which would make more sense. But I like to imagine that. I just have shitty luck. <laughs> So, Freddy's, Freddy's just casually riding his bike around town right now, making my way. Probably down. riding back to the base to inform me. <laughs> yeah, probably. So, I go to stealth and die. You try to duck behind Jeremiah so, when, so, to realize that there is someone behind Jeremiah that you guys have not noticed. <laughs> oh, <coughs> yes, someone who seems to radiate a purple glow with their purple short top cut hair. Oh no. <laughs> this is not good. This is definitely the opposite of okay. Atlas was not going to be inside of this scenario. You're not one allowed it to happen. <laughs> oh god my damn god. it, JJ. <laughs> uh, can, I, can I just be like, oh, well, hi, this is... Fantasy and you here? Hi. Yes. Uh, since you guys are a terrorist, I decided you guys are worth my time. So please come with us, or I will assure you uh, this will not be fun for you guys. You guys, all of the other, all of the rest of you now notice the appearance of Atlas. Um, and you guys uh, see King, I've had you just go. I would listen to her. She packs a mean punch. She and like if we that. do, if we do comply, then what will happen to us? Well, if we do comply, we'll keep you in our facility until we think that possibly you won't kill people anymore. <laughs> Which perhaps maybe never, if you guys want to be dicks about it. But. Hopefully, is in like I don't know two seconds. And if uh, we don't, <laughs> Jack's just gonna elbow uh, Jeremiah in the back <laughs> and just so gonna be make like... sure that you guys in this pathetic little warehouse that you're in um, get to visit the moon. <laughs> uh, I'm gonna lean back to Jeremiah and be... I'm gonna go find Freddy. I'll come back for you, and then just. Super chill. Super yeah. <laughs> CR CR ten speed check. Speed? CR ten? Okay. Yes. Dex thirty-three. Uh, Alright. Effort. Uh, specialized in running. Alright. So that's a CR four now, right? Yes. And then trained in using my power. All right, CR five. So, or CR three. So Please. nine or higher. For the love of God. <laughs> oh, God. I love that we used up all of our XP to do something really cool, and now is yeah. the time where we could have used all of that XP. Yeah, that's kind um, of like spend XP. Jack cannot roll good in the clutch, so that's good. So, to know. you. Turn to just book it as fast as you can, and as you begin to run, you can't move. You are stuck. Did you step in glue, my dude? Like, I don't know. You guys see a the purplish glow around this new figure begin to grow as they have that hand outstanding. Um, towards Jack. It's like, I don't think you're going anywhere. What's well, so, This normally doesn't happen. You people have powers too? Who the fuck are you people? Well, I mean, it happens that, uh, I don't have very four guys. I mean, I guess no problem if I can't get up right now. This, these are people that you <laughs> should not mess with. And that you should very much listen. Is Charles next to me? Yes. 
Do you pick up Charles and throw him at it? So, <laughs> how, 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 so how far <laughs> is uh, how far is Atlas from me? Directly behind you. So probably about like ten feet behind you. Hmm. Ten feet. Like five feet, I think. I said ten feet. Yes, Brandon, ten feet. <laughs> Just checking. <laughs> so this is a like good Charles. scenario. Hey Charles, uh, uh, hmm, can you maybe, hmm, you know, do whatever you do? So, an NPC versus NPC scenarios. I must use their CR levels. There is no roles that I do. Technically, Charles is a CR 1, but for the benefit of the doubt, I'll make him CR 3 since he has powers and power shield. This does not trump Atlas CR 10. <laughs> so, Charles I'm begins to outreach his hand to grab on Atlas and is frozen inside of the same state that you are. Oh, I, I was more leaning to the fact that he could give me the power shifts he had, help me break out, so that way I can get out of here. But trying to fist fight this purple lady, spot on. <laughs> we are screwed. <laughs> I'm so happy Freddy's not there, I'll be honest. <laughs> Freddy could make this Well, situation. you're heading now. I am, <laughs> but... I'm not there yet, so I'm hoping that by the time I get there, they're gone. Yeah, along with us, probably. Sorry, sometimes when you make an omelette, you have to break some eggs. And it's unfortunate that all of you guys are the eggs, but it's fine. I will carry on your legacy. <laughs> Second character to die in the villain campaign? Who is? Who is this <laughs> kind of like Jack. <laughs> Rest in peace, my bro. Hmm. I want to try something. I don't know if this is, can work, but if it can, it's going to be kind of cool. All right. I, I like want cool. to. So, you know, like in the comics, how Flash can super speed hit the molecules in his body to almost phase through certain yeah. materials? Can I try doing that against the gravity? All right. Like, so I will say. What you're trying to do is something that you get tears of head. But, since I like your initiative, I will say it's a CR 12 roll with a cost of 4 speed. Okay. Your edge okay. does not go into the cost. Okay. So since I'm trying to like run as well, would that include the running? Or... Um, yes. Okay, so I can bring stuff down by 7, I'm pretty sure. Alright, so it's a CR 6, so it'd be a CR... 5. CR 5. 5. So 15 or higher. Come on, JJ. Please, just let me roll good for once this easy, session. Easy, easy. It'd be so cool if this works. Nope. Mm. You rolled above a 10, technically. I know, dude. Just I'm, I'm actually pumped about that. <laughs> so, you, um, Atlas is now looking at Jeremiah. So, are you going to come with us, or do I have to fly all of you guys today? What do you mean by fly? Um, she lifts her hand, and both the frozen statues of Jack and um, Charles just sort of float into the air. What the fuck? Let go. You're gonna come with us? I just gonna look away. And around this time, Brandon, oh, fuck. You, 
You guys here? No, if you can enthrall to let her let us go. You guys I mean, here? Uh -huh. Outside, and Atlas goes, Jack. Who is it? Oh, Jack. What? <laughs> oh no. <laughs> you guys are mega terrorists. You guys <laughs> didn't think that they'd bring out the big guns, huh? I wouldn't call Jack a big gun. I'd call Jack a fucking wimp. Kane is a big gun. Atlas is a big gun. Jack, we've kind of dealt with multiple times. <laughs> By himself, he's almost taken out all of you. <laughs> but he didn't. <laughs> it took the help of wildfire to expose his position. Well, yeah, because he's a fucking motherfucker, invisible bitch. Fuck. Yeah. I'm angry. <laughs> Continue. So yeah, uh, Freddy, you're rolling up. Do I notice anything strange? No. No. Car is there. Door is closed. Alright. Personally, I honestly, Freddy doesn't really want to go in here. Like he wants to get back to his man, to his now mansion. So he's probably just gonna pull out his phone and give Jack a call. Uh, Jack. Your phone starts ringing, which you cannot reach. <laughs> hey, hello, uh, Purpley. I uh, think that might be uh, a call. Can I please take it? It's from your friend outside. Uh, fine. Um, she drops the status field around you. Oh, okay, thank God. Okay. Tell him nothing's wrong inside. It'd be easier okay. if all of you guys are inside of a group. Okay. So, so while he's on the phone, can I try to break free? You're not frozen. from what? Yeah, yeah, yeah you're, you're not, not frozen. Being the... Oh wait, I thought it was frozen. No, you're the only one that didn't act out, so <laughs> you aren't frozen. <laughs> Ready? Right. What's up, Jack? Guess is what? Fine. Nothing going on wrong in here. We're all just fine and dandy. Atlas you know, goes. Just... Uh, could you sound like? Les at gunpoint, uh, she takes the gu the phone from your hands. It's like, hey, we have your friends. Come inside of here, or I swear to God, I'll send this place into the sun. Do I still have that gun that I took from the police officer on me? Um, I would say yeah. See, it's funny because she's challenging Freddy right now. <laughs> and she's going to learn very quickly that she shouldn't do that. Is she still on the phone? Yeah. Okay. So I um I enthrall her while I'm talking to her on the phone. While talking to right. grab and keep another creature's attention. So I just start talking. I'm like, oh okay, you know what? That's actually a really good idea. But What's you know what the... would be even Is there anything on enthrall that nope. like about CR? Nope. I know, I know this okay. by heart because I because M has used it against Joker, and there was no role or anything that I could make. For as long as I do nothing but speak, the other ta creature takes no actions other than to defend itself. So right. could Jack recognize this and try to use that as an advantage to get the hell out of here? He has heard me use Enthrall before. I will point that out. I've been enthralled firsthand, so I should know what it is. <laughs> oh wait, you have been enthralled. <laughs> yeah. Oh yeah. So. Give me a speed check, because you're just trying to run now. This time, CR, CR, well not 12, CR 10. Can I be an asset since I'm currently enthralling Atlas? Yeah. No, it's CR 10 because Atlas is not involved. This is including oh. all the other agents. Oh, well, I believe in before you, I, Before I make my speed roll, can I say split and then take off? Yeah. <laughs> split! <laughs> Alright, so <coughs> dexterity, effort, that's four. Running, specialized, that's six. And then using speed power, trained in. Would this be defense or no? No, this is not defense. Okay, so CR3. Okay. Let's go! Oh my Holy God. shit, thank oh, God. I actually passed a roll. Let's go. <laughs> Wait, what? This wasn't supposed to happen. 
You right. actually, yeah, you book it out of there. Yeah. And you, you think you see a glint of something as you exit the door of something that was supposedly blocking it, <laughs> but you just barrel through it. <laughs> and you're outside by Jack now. By Freddy, you mean? Or by Freddy, yeah. All right. So I'm assuming I see Jack, so I'm just going to keep yeah. talking. I'm going to keep um, enthralling, so all I just have to do is keep talking, so I'm going to be like, yeah, no, yes. you know what? You should really tell me your name, because, like, you sound like a really pretty person. Hey, Jack, you should keep <sighs> running. But, um, yeah, since you sound really fucking hot, like, you want to tell it. me your name, honey? <laughs> like, um, I think this would go into initiative. <laughs> oh, no. as, um, as the other agents are going to become hostile as Jack runs away. It's okay. What's the CR? <laughs> CR is like, CR is eight. CR is four for me because I have three decks and I'm trained in initiative. All right. Uh, so, you two get to go first, specifically Freddy first. <laughs> okay. Um. Well. I can't do anything other than enthrall right now, so I guess I'm just going to continue enthralling. But I'd like to be prepared that if I, like, notice something about to shoot at me... Actually, wait. No. If I notice, like, anything, like, off, like, I'm about to be shot at, um, I would like to be able to dodge. <laughs> so can I continue? You cannot continue on enthrall and dodge. <laughs> okay. I guess I'm just going to keep up with enthrall, then. Okay. Um, Jack, your turn. I assume I know what it is. So where where I saw that glint at, is that outside of the? That was in the doorway. Oh, okay. Uh. So essentially, I am going to grab on to Freddy and. Put him on the bike, and we're getting the hell out of there. <laughs> I can't move. Uh, well, well, you're not moving. I am moving you. <laughs> him grabbing onto you technically breaks the enthrall. Yeah. So, well, no, it's uh, if it's only if I do something. So if he grabs onto me, but I don't move or anything, then like as long as I don't take any physical actions, looking at enthrallus as while talking. Even the creature can't understand you. For as long as you do nothing but speak, you can't even move. So, as long as I don't... So, like, if he grabs me, I just can't move. Like... Yes, but I don't know if it means you move physically or of your own volition. Even then, even then, when you get yanked, I assume you make a noise. <laughs> I'm still talking, though, technically. I could just. That's technically I'm... not a conversation. You scream. Yeah, this and isn't not a talking. conversation, though. This is just me talking at the person extremely, extremely quickly that they are mesmerized by my words. Yes, but it has to be words. <laughs> but it's even if the person can't understand me. So if the person can't understand the words I'm using, then. <laughs> it doesn't mean it's still words. <laughs> God I damn it. you for trying to argue with something. You cannot just speak gibberish. And it... All right, so anyways. God damn it, JJ. <laughs> I was, all right, I'm going to give you. Doesn't know how... Roll, roll, give me an intellect save of six. Me? Yes, you. Okay, I'm trained in intellect defense rules. Um, so I have five. two in power? No. Okay. That so, would not save you. Okay, it is just a CR5. Yeah, it's just a CR5. Yikes. Okay. <laughs> God damn it. You cannot withhold a yelp as you are dragged away at 22 miles per hour. Freddy, what the fuck? <laughs> oh, wait, not Freddy. <laughs> Jack, what the fuck? <laughs> and Atlas is activated. <laughs> Well, so, um, let's get I, I'm still holding on to the cell phone, though. <laughs> like, I just have to wait for my turn to possibly enthrall her if she's still holding on to the cell phone. So, since it's now their turn, Atlas is going to look at the cell phone and be like, What the fuck? 
and throw it. <laughs> God damn it. God damn it, So Judy. we're taking off, right? <laughs> and she flies oh. out of the door, and she is now above you two. But I thought as soon as I jumped on, we were driving. No, no. your action was to get onto the bike. <sighs> wait, don't I move a short distance and then? Oh, no, wait, no, that's getting, okay, yeah. Yeah. All right. This is fun. And... <laughs> hey, Jack, buddy, what the actual fuck? The bike that you two are on starts to go up. I jump off. <laughs> oh, God damn it. <laughs> damn it. <laughs> And it's, right now, probably 40 feet in the air. <laughs> oh, God. This is fine. I'll be right back. I gotta go help my dad with something. So, just treat me. All right. <laughs> now, going on to the other agent's turn. King. What would King do in this scenario? Nothing, because he's King. a little bitch. <laughs> King raises his hand. It's like, oh, well, I guess it's fighting time. And a, okay. you see, it looks like his armor is moving, and it moves to his hand and starts forming a massive great hammer. Oh. As the nanotechnology in his suit begins to move around. Oh. Realize that was he, the first time we've seen King's power. <laughs> yeah. His 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 text his suit text is that he has nanobots that. He can move around at will. Alright. That's pretty cool. Kinda, kinda so he don't can form like that. he can form objects, create protective barriers, uh, make his armor more dense. He's a lot of versatility. So are there like I have a question? No. Where we're at in the base, is there any trees nearby? Um, I would say no. Because this is a factory sort of spot. Like uh, telephone poles, yes, post. I would say. Yeah. Okay. That helps me out with my idea. Um, but uh, King forms a giant great hammer and runs in between Jeremiah and the door. Wait, so he's running after them? No, does, does he's stopping like you from leaving. Are there like any orbs or anything that shows like around the Warhammer or something? What? So is there any like you said what when it forms the uh the Warhammer, right? Is it like an orb or something? No. It's a bunch of nano but nano uh tech making it. Uh can I try to fire my gun at him? Uh it's not your turn yet. Alright. Um, next would be Jack, who, um, was going to go after, uh, Jack and Freddy, who are now 40 feet in the air, Good. <laughs> so he holds his invisible position. Um, next would be Jeremiah. Actually... Okay, yeah, I'm just going to fire my gun at him. Alright, uh, give me a speed check. CR... CR5. Are you using a pistol? Yes. The CR goes down by one. Cock cock. CR... I'm training the weapons. Well, that's if it's a light pistol. Well, yeah, all pistols are light pistols. Pistols are a light it's weapon. A... <laughs> Yes, police officer pistol. No, I, I, so. I saw medium pistols. Ah, well, is a police uh, is a police pistol a medium pistol or a light pistol? No, it's a light pistol. <laughs> He's gonna say. <laughs> I have oh, so it. plus two decks. Yeah, that would help in here. So CR two. Oh, oh yikes! Oh Bruh. yikes! Oh yikes! What has been the Did worst he roll in that one? Session? He rolled in that yes. one. Oh, I have to give you guys GM and Tuesdays this soon. See, I, I want to give you GM and Tuesdays to give you XP, but you guys are doing so bad that I don't want to screw you guys even more. 
we're already doing terrible enough without the GM intrusions. <laughs> like, so. Also, I like how you said the roles you did earlier were good for us, and now you have brought in three different ways to fuck us. Well, that's because we, you guys rolled once. <laughs> we rolled one one. There were still two ways to fuck us in the beginning. Well, there's the other two ways. Jack and King! Oh, well, yeah, they were going to be there. <laughs> you guys can take on Jack and King. Atlas had it on. It's okay. I have. I'm gonna take care of Atlas this turn. And if Jack fucking grabs onto me again, I'm gonna fucking kill Jack. <laughs> also, I should have mentioned as you guys are flying, you're in stasis. I feel like this is some bullshit. That is honestly on me that I forgot to mention. I apologize. I feel like this was something that you planned. Um, well, yeah. After she realized you could use words to stop her, she wasn't going to let you talk again. Well, everyone else was able to talk when they were in stasis. I'm able to talk still. They, technically, in my mind, they stopped with their mouth open. I, I would have stopped with my mouth open, too. I was yelling at Jack. <laughs> Alright, fine. But still, I will make you roll for it. But that's in the future. That's um, um, so you fire the gun into into uh, King. That's his name. And the bullet sort of just bounces off his very dense armor he has right now. He goes, huh. <laughs> Do you want to see firepower? I can show you firepower. And the nanobites on his shoulder begin to morph into dual Gatling guns. <laughs> <laughs> and he just starts spraying. Um, take 10 damage. <laughs> as you are just filled <laughs> with lead. Oh, fuck. Brandon, I believe in you. Rock on. Get it? Because you have stone skin. It's a joke. Rock on. Oh. Yeah. <laughs> I'm glad I made at least myself laugh. So, moving on in the order list, I think he goes to the top. Hello. Also, Charles is in stasis, so he gets no move. <laughs> Hello, it's my turn. Yes, it is your turn. I am ready to try and throw Atlas. All right, CR CR seven might check. Might. Yes, because you're trying to force through the stasis tiny bits of jaw movement to form words. <laughs> Can I use power since I'm technically using my powers to make these words? I'd have to say, I'll let it, I'll let it, because I feel okay. like you don't have anything else to put in this. I have on. nothing else to put in this. I have two in power, so I yeah. have a CR5 now. <laughs> What's going on? Okay. Uh, um, She's trying to enthrall again. Yeah, so CR5. Okay. 15 or high. God damn it. God damn it. Fuck shit. JJ, I'm sorry, but I'm so angry at you. <laughs> it's, that's not my Tricky fault. Jimmy does no not know that. Come out. I am angry. Thomas had never seen such bullshit in his <laughs> life before. Um, I at least you get a nat one. What's the worst that could have happened with a nat one? Atlas just fucking throws me across so, the but, warehouse. Like... Jack, you are in stasis, but you can attempt a might roll to remove yourself from it. I didn't even get a chance to like fight against it. What? What? No, you don't. You don't get a chance to roll against stasis. Stasis just happens since it is a CR ten ability. <laughs> that is so good. Oh my. That's uh... such bullshit. <laughs> just CR ten creatures are the highest creature in the book that are made. 
Oh, Demigod or CR10. If Torrin was here, Torrin could just punch Atlas and then she'd be dead. Yeah. But that's not happening now, so. <laughs> uh, let's just say I'll try and break out. Because there's nothing else I can do. Okay. Can that's I, I wasn't face? holding on to the butt. Uh huh. <laughs> um, CR10 might uh, defense. Or could I do that, uh, try to phase out the thing? Yes, but it'd be the same difficulty. <laughs> what was that? Actually, no, CR12. It'd actually be harder. That's what it was for. Yeah. It was 12 before. Yeah, was I was 12... just saying, I brought it down actually, by 2 because I was past it. Um, I would say CR, CR8. But still with a cost of four speed. I didn't you cut out for me. What was it? CR eight, but with a cost of four speed. Okay. CR eight. So oh, make sure you spend that. four speed. Yeah, that's what I'm doing, right? Uh so Dex, effort, that brings it down by four. Alright. Running, time to free oh. myself. So that brings it down by Two more, so that's CR6, bring it down, and then CR2. Oh, down to, yeah, CR2. And then using power. Alright, then Does CR1. Count for defense, for finally? Yes, What's the this is a defense. So, <laughs> <I'm at success. laughs> Hell yeah. Thank god, because I knew I would have rolled a two. <laughs> you have just been... Trying to move as fast as you can in this very, very small. Oh. You, you may have just lost Dante. Yeah. Air 404. <laughs> Hello. Seven. Hello. You yeah. help? So. I apologize for that. <laughs> I have an idea. Don't know if it's gonna work, but it's cool. <laughs> yeah. I like cool. <laughs> I told you. I have to... <laughs> so if I was to grab Charles, would that knock him out of stasis? What? If I was to grab Charles, would that knock him out of stasis? You don't know. Okay. So. It is Jack's turn, if I'm not mistaken, because Freddy just failed trying to put Atlas in mm -hmm. a trance. Um, it is, uh, what's the name? King. King Shrimp. Yeah, King, you broke free with your Ready's action. up. Oh, okay. Ready's up as um, uh, his that... massive giant hammer. And goes to swing it down right on Jeremiah's head, who's now quite hurt from the many bullet wounds he's just taken. When a sound could be heard. Somewhere up above, you can hear. Yes, yes. Rats has a transform. Yeah. What? Rats has become more like rat. Yes, yes. Rats attack, attack. And you see, you hear as swarms of rats start to come. From seemingly nowhere. <gasps> I know which one this is. I know what Power Rats has. <laughs> I, as a player, know. I, Freddy has no fucking idea. And, uh, <laughs> um, King looks around confused to all hell. He's like, what? Where do these come from? Is this from you? As he starts to stomp on the rats. And, you remember vividly what rats look like. This doesn't look like rats. <laughs> the monstrous form of a about four foot tall humanoid rat leaps from the rafters with a sharp rusty dagger in hand. 
and leaps onto the back of King and just starts stabbing. Well then. Can I help and then punch King? It's not your turn. Okay. <laughs> I feel like Rats is about to get shot by um, certain jet Moving cards. over, we have Atlas. Who lifts uh, Freddy up higher while they're in stasis. You they're bitch. now 80 feet in the air. Then looks down at Jack and says, You better not run, or I swear to God, your friend will come plummeting down. <laughs> That's what you think. <laughs> and then moving over, there's Jack. He just stays Jack. <laughs> you guys have no idea. <laughs> um, and then moving over, we have Jeremiah. So I'm gonna try to leap for an uppercut on Agent King. CR, uh, five to hit. Uh, does Dex count? No, because this is a uh, might thing. Uh, I have plus two strength. This is technically your attack, so that does not help. If you have accuracy or anything involving like hand to hand combat, or maybe you can just use effort to bring it. Uh, does Pactus with all weapons count? It's like my fists? Mm. No, but I'll let it. So it was a CR5, it's down to what, CR3 now? CR4. CR4. Alright, let's do this. Woo! Come on. Oh, Triple hell yeah! Hey! you, bitch. Right in the How much jaw. Huh? How much damage do you do? He has two strength. I have plus two strength. So, so plus six, and if he has the no need for weapon, that's fine. I don't think he has no need for weapon. <laughs> so then it's eight. Alright. Yeah, that's eight damage. Let me pull up King's sheet. Um, you uppercut him, and you feel nail bites, uh, nano machine crushing under your fist, but you never feel it connect the skin. He has eight armor. He doesn't, but it's just you didn't do that much damage. <laughs> oh, okay. Oh fuck! I was gonna say Joker has that much armor, guys. Like, have eight armor. Each person yeah. has their own special thing inside the organization. Uh, Joker's thing was armor. <laughs> they were the yeah. walking tank. So no one has more armor than Joker. <laughs> yeah, and the eight is with the shield and everything. So like, she has eight when she has her shield, but she doesn't have her shield up. She only has seven. Yeah, so no one has more than Joker. Alrighty then. <laughs> so is it back up to the top for combat? Please? Uh, yes, Please. it is. Okay. I'm going to try and enthrall Atlas again. Same roll. Okay, it's going to be a CR5 for my two power. Uh, hell yeah! <laughs> Let's go. Let's go. Come back, here comes the comeback. <laughs> here comes the comeback. As you start to enthrall Atlas, what do you say? Alright, listen here, you motherfucker. I first of all, the fact that you were gonna drop me eighty feet, that's kinda of rude. I kind of am hurt by that. Honestly, it's kind of fair. He basically just starts going off like insulting her and saying how hurt he is as a person. Atlas is only enthralled because she is so shocked that you have the gall <laughs> to talk to her. <laughs> Inside of this moment. <laughs> She's just the pure shock. <laughs> the one of like, how the fuck did she even get out of stasis? And like, how dare she talk to me like that when she's 80 feet in the air? <laughs> or he. 
I feel like after I get, if Enthrall ends, Freddy's gonna get dropped about 80 feet. <laughs> Unless you use Enthrall to have her put you down. Nope. And <laughs> Enthrall no. just stops them moving. Yeah, so she can't take any actions unless it's to defend herself right now. But same is said for Fred. <laughs> yes. So you guys are so just, there is talking, no getting just down. chilling 80 feet. <laughs> yeah. Honestly, Freddy's been in worse scenarios. Um, right. I guess so, that's true. And for all, it's such a good move when there's like a CR-10 enemy against CR-1s. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Wait, hold on, hold on. I'm technically a CR-2, alright? Listen. <laughs> I'm a tier 2 villain. Give me that much. Fine. A group of CR-1s and a CR-2. Thank you. That you threw three CR-10s um, against. <laughs> no, three CR-8s and then one yes, CR-10. CR <laughs> Thank you, thank you, JJ. They are CR eights. <laughs> Atlas is the only CR ten. That's not much better. <laughs> so two demigods and a god versus people that are like, yeah, we're tough, but have like five health. Freddy be like. <laughs> <laughs> so, Jack, what do you do? Well, I'm taking it. I'm on the ground now, right? Yes, you are on the ground. Can he, can Jack remember where the glimmer was when he was running out? The doorway. That's where you no, remember. So he's going to try to build up speed to barrel his way into whatever was glimmer. Um, I won't make you, I won't make you do a roll. Because as you barrel through, it's not there anymore. <laughs> It's a weird how Jack moves. Disgusting. Imagine. Precisely. So, do I still have my action or was that my action? What? Because technically, what? I just moved. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. So, I have another, like, hundred and something feet, pretty sure. Yeah. If I see King right there in the doorway, right? You see yeah, had, King uh, being stabbed by a monstrous looking yeah. rat. Okay. So, what Jack is going to do is ye old faithful trying to suffocate King by spinning around. You're going to suffocate the rat too. Poor rats. He, he lived his. Never mind. I'm going to stop myself right there. Uh, can you give me, give me a intellect check, CR5. Intellect, okay. <laughs> this is just the beginning. I just want you to understand the full scenario, the intellect check to make sure that you do. Okay. Feels like, wait a minute. <laughs> oh! Oh my god. Holy shit! Um, oh you suffocating that? We'll do nothing. That suit... We'll keep give him oxygen. This is this is not this does not please. Also, Nat twenty, uh, Jack's like to the left. <laughs> he like, he's just like five feet to the left of you right now. Can I try and attack Jack then, or do the same thing that I would to Jack, or would the suit protect Jack as well? Um, would your Nat twenty? You assume that the suit would protect all of them. Like, okay. they're designed to go underwater, like, how even be in space, just places where the atmosphere is here as well. Okay, so can I try and attack Jack then? Yes. Uh, give me a CR 10 roll. Jack versus Jack. Technically, since this is dexterity versus dexterity, could I use mine to help me out? Or... Use your what? Can I use my dexterity to help me? Since this is a speed versus speed matchup, essentially. I would say, flavor it to me how you would to make it a speed trick. So, essentially, how Jack fights is not more of brute power. It's more of overwhelming speed to gain momentum as he attacks. So, when he's punching, he's not punching to break you. He's punching enough to, like, essentially overwhelm you. 
So all right, then I'll let you use it, uh, all your speed stuff, but you can no longer use your mic stuff for this. Okay. So what do I do? Would I still do ten damage or no? If that's the case. Um. No. Okay. So I do four damage. Yes, you do four. Okay. So, dexterity three. That brings it down to a seven. Effort brings that down to a six. Using my power would bring that down to a five. A three or five to hit. All right, 15 or higher. Hey, thank hey. God. Let's go. Yep. All right. You turn to the side seeing a glimpse of something moving and just sprint at it, just flowing, throwing as many throws, I mean, throwing as many punches as you can in a second. <laughs> um, now I have to check how much armor Jack has. <laughs> Monk's flurry of butt blows be like. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, this was that, but like times 10. Oh, nice. The wood dex add to damage now, or since I'm using speed based no. attacks? Dex doesn't actually ever add to damage, so I would not. Uh, would not. Okay. That's the. That's the. Um, that's the trade-off you have to do. You get all the benefits of rolling with your speed, but you lose all the damage that you get if you fight with me. True. So the um, your punches do hit on hard steel as you're punching into Jack, and you're pretty sure it definitely doesn't hurt as much as you want it to do, but you definitely feel some impacts. Okay. Oh, I'm, mm, oh my god, I am stupid. I have the handcuffs from the cops. Yes, you uh, do. And the guns. I should have tried to just handcuff Jack. Yeah, it's fine. What? Yeah, I'll, I'll keep that in mind next turn, I guess. <laughs> Alright, I guess it's King's turn now, right? Or is it Atlas's turn? Atlas um, can't do shit. <laughs> Yeah, Atlas is uh, stuck, um, and King um, is trying to fight Rat and trying to get Rat off of his back. Um, he's just trying to grab around, and you see Rat who's grabbing on and stabbing in. Um, the net, the armor that he's grabbing on, starts to form around his hands, so he cannot. Pull away. And, uh, uh, King grab, uh, using his hammer and smashing into Rat's back. And you see Rat just go limp. What's his name? Jack is going to try to fight Jack using his katana. Uh, so CR. DR8 speed defense. Okay. So dexterity, three, effort. Alright, so down by four. four. And I don't, aren't you trained in speed defense? Yes, speed defense without armor. And would this be using my power since I. Uh, technically, no. Okay. So it was down by five, so it's CR3. Damn it. That's gonna hurt a lot. So you do get splashed up by Jack's blade, as you're not expecting him to uh, attack back with the speed that he does, and take six damage. That hurts a lot. Two might left. This is fun. I <laughs> have four. And. Who's trying to do it now? Jeremiah. So what we're gonna do is I'm gonna try to grab Charles and say Charles, suck the life from him, and we're gonna throw Charles at him. <laughs> Give me a mic check. CR ten. Ten? Yeah. <laughs> uh, <laughs> does two two strength count? Yeah. CR eight. CR eight. <laughs> Uh, Do you have any way to bring him down by at least two more? 
There's effort. Yes, that's one. Yes. <laughs> Unless you leveled up your effort before anything else. Huh? Unless you have Unless you leveled up your effort. Yeah. Wait, what was that going to do? Unless you have two things of effort. I only have one. Yes. Yes. So, automatic failure. <laughs> um, Charles is mega stuck. <laughs> You are not. You are not strong enough. You feel them almost much, but not really. <laughs> so yeah, you're not getting Charles out of this position. Fuck. Um... Oh wait, fuck! I should have said I could have been an asset because I'm enthralling her right now. You Damn could it. have said that. I'm an but... idiot. <laughs> Moving on, back to the top of the round. I assume I know what you're doing. And you know what? My mom was a hardworking woman, and she didn't need any man yeah. to help take care of her so, other than me. <laughs> going on your life story. On your, yeah. <laughs> Freddy's unloading Jack. his tragic backstory onto this poor woman. <laughs> Who is still just shell-shocked. So, I wanted to try something. Is there a wall nearby where I'm at right now? Hmm? Is there a wall nearby where I'm at now? Um, the factory wall. Uh, yeah. To your left. There's one about 10 feet. JJ, pull us out of here. I could, but I can't get Charles. <laughs> or Freddy. <laughs> yeah. He'd be getting so what I'm gonna do, half the team out. <laughs> what I'm gonna do is kind of like propel myself off the wall and roundhouse kick Jet to like See if I can. Ooh, I'm gonna use try to use might on this one to do more right. damage. But would me going fast be an asset at all? I'll let it be an asset. Okay. So, what would the CR be to hit? CR the same as before. CR ten. So that's an asset. Brings it down to nine. Would running count because that's what I'm doing on the wall? And that's more. I'll let it. Okay, so specialized in running, that brings it down to CR7. And using my hand power hand. On the, in the wall, and then hand to hand. So CR5. Would strength help? Would that just bring strength that Strength would does not help here, but it will okay. increase the damage. Okay, so CR5, I believe. Fifteen or higher. Rolling the dice. Oh, no. <laughs> well, I regret saying that. What did so he roll? He rolled a two. Okay, just checking if it was a one. Um, you do a very cool move, but Jack is very fast <laughs> and able to back up as you try to just knock his lights out. Now, All moving right. on, NCC turn. Atlas is still in thrall. <laughs> yeah, Atlas is no show. <laughs> Atlas is previously engaged. Um, so, try to decide if this should happen. Is it going to help us? Not really. Just saying. If I would have rolled, like, if I would have had a, a 20 on that hit, Jack's head was going to go flying like a soccer ball, and there's nothing <laughs> that anyone could say that would have stopped me. <laughs> I thought in that 20 you can't kill people, even on a mess. Nope, it's a okay. major effect. No. Technically, you can, on, I always forget this, on 17s, you can uh, add one damage. 18, you can add two damage. Oh, so I did five when I previously hit Jack. Okay. Because he used this, he rolled a 17 to hit Jack before. I always forget that there's different special rules for combat and out of combat. So I did five damage when hitting Jack. That's how torn does armor, even yeah. more damage. <laughs> I think in 19, you can take plus three damage. And I think a major effect, you can put, take plus four. Actually, I'll say major effect. Major effect, you take plus five. All right. 
Um, so, rat, unconscious. Um, uh, King, why do I keep forgetting his name? King <laughs> looked over at Jeremiah and was like, no, word, word. And starts to swing his hammer at Jeremiah. I need his speed defense roll. What's the CR? Jeremiah. CR would be eight. Uh, plus two dex. All right, CR six. Does CR. running count as well, or? No. Uh, with fifteen or higher to avoid. Oh, Ooh, that's a sixteen. Nice. Um, you were able to move out at the last possible second to not get your head knocked off by this giant hammer. And moving on, we have Jack. Same role as before. Would running help me? Because if I try to dodge speed, would that help? Because if I use running, I think I can bring that down to a CR1. Well, you cannot use running in this scenario. Okay, so I think it's a CR3 st- yeah. Come on, JJ. Alright, let's go. 14. I wish I could give a GM intrusion to NPC. Why? It's to help you guys. Oh. <laughs> well, if you want to give one of us 3 XP right now and get let it, we could do a player intrusion and you could just tell us what we should do. <laughs> no. God damn it. So, you, as. Lightning fast as Jack move, you move faster. Um, and are a- able to dodge out of the way of his katana. Right, because that would have hurt very bad. I would have been probably dead. You're only now, dead if you lose pools in all three of your pools. Jeremiah. Your turn. Uh, well, the wound was on uh, Agent King. Like, after Rats stabbed him, are those open wounds? Um, you assume they'd be on his back, you can't see, because he is facing forward. So what you doing, Jeremiah? Does he still have those guns on the, on his shoulders? Yes, but they're not active. So what I'm going to do is try to tackle him down to the ground. What? I'm sorry, what? Actually, uh, I'm just going to, yeah, I'm going to try to tackle him to the ground. Alright, give me a mic check. CR head. Alright, let's go, Jeremiah. Bring it down. Uh, take it back now. Five plus, this time. Plus two strength. Alright. Actually, are you trying to tackle him or hit him? Uh, I think we're going to tackle him. Alright, then yeah. So, plus two strength can apply to this. And wait, so is this going towards CRA. speed? Is this going towards speed then, since I'm tackling? No. <laughs> tackling is a mic roll. Uh. Okay, so strength and how much is it? Effort to seven. What? If I use effort, would that take it to seven? Yeah. Yeah, that take it to eight. That take it to seven. Yeah. Uh, so you need it to bring it down one more time. Could we say, since um, King might be a little flustered after having someone jump on his back, that he might be caught a little bit off guard if Brandon is tackling him currently? Yes. You have a CR6. <laughs> Alright, so when I use effort, is that I have two in my edge, right? And then... So it only costs one. Okay. And then you gotta roll an 18 or higher. Well, that's not an 18. It's not higher than an 18. Oof. That's a 3. So, um, Jeremiah runs into, uh, into King's midsection and then stops. <laughs> and just... literally looks like he just ran into a wall. Oof. Now, moving back up to the top of the round, we have <laughs> Freddy doing And that is thing. why you're not allowed to go bowling without wearing shoes. A fun story that I really wish I had learned before I went bowling without shoes. You know how many toes I've All broken right, so, on this? 
<laughs> Jack? <laughs> How many times I broke my toes with bowling balls? <laughs> hmm. Well, actually, I know what I'm going to I'm going to try to speed and handcuff Jack. That would be a CR 10 check. Dexterity, effort, four, drinks that time, six, running, specialized, bring that down, a six, that is CR4, and using the power for speed, that is a CR3. All right. Nice. Whew. Come on. Yes. Twelve. Let's go. Let's go. Somehow. You are able to move fast enough to click both, to grab onto the wrist of um, Jack and click on the handcuffs onto both of his wrists at the same time. Does this make him drop his weapon? Or? No, he still holds on to it. It's just going to be a lot more difficult for him to use it. <laughs> <laughs> All right, let's go. I think All that right. ends my turn. Yeah, moving on. We now have uh, NPCs. Atlas is enthralled. Rats is unconscious. Jack can't really move. He can move. He can easily move. It's just that it's it's easier to run from him now. <laughs> um, but give me whoever wants to give me an intellect check. Cr four. Hey, I'm enthralling. I'm enthralling someone, so Freddy's not Which paying attention to anything around him. Uh, Dante, I, I pass. Okay. JJ got a 14. What's the check? Intellect. Intellect. CR4. CR4. I have plus one intellect. So CR3. CR3. Brandon got a nope. 7. Nice. That still fails. <laughs> um, so, so, Jack, uh, Jack, you here. And Jack, headset, um, as you're clicking handcuffs on him, you hear, um, Mayday, Mayday, we have an emergency at Site Alpha. Emergency at Site Alpha. Please, all agents, come to me. All right. Behind this, <laughs> you see Jack's going to kind of smirk as he hears this through the headset, saying, oh, leaving so soon. <laughs> <coughs> um, Jack sort of glares at you. Sure, I'll roll for this. <laughs> what are you rolling for? <laughs> I'm concerned. Oh, yeah, I don't have internet catch. Uh -huh. I'll do it in my turn. Oh, yeah, the server doesn't have the bot. We can roll <laughs> for you. Yeah, if you want us to roll for you, we can. Like... Isn't it what dice? I roll. I roll. Oh. Okay, so. What was I rolling for? Um, something as a reaction from Jack oh, yeah. as Jack smirks at Jack. Uh, Jack breaks the handcuffs that are on you his wrist. You weren't supposed to do that. <laughs> <laughs> you weren't supposed to do that. Hey, that's and not fair. Goes invisible. Well, you used to see Jack's face go visible confusion. <laughs> Oh wait, Jack's never not met, dealt with Jack before. And... This is just uh, sweet? Yeah. <laughs> He's just like... Damn. Uh, fine. Last ditch effort. And... His armor begins to shed and crawl amongst the four. And... You all feel a little tickled crawling up your legs. <laughs> I'm 80 feet in but the air. <laughs> I, I'm about to say, except for you. <laughs> Can Jack try and like shake these off, or is this not allowed? Oh uh, yeah, you just like start like patting down your leg to like tell it to stop. What the fuck? Um, give everyone, give me a speed or oh, everyone, you two. Give me a speed <laughs> check, uh, CR 10. Speed defense. Oh. While this is happening, I will be right back. Okay. 
Speed defense. Two yeah. decks. Okay. So bring that down by five. So it's a C out of five. Okay. Roll a six. You roll a six? Okay. Yep. So I have one in edge for speed. If I use effort, is that just. Yes. Yeah. Can so you bring it down to a six? Does running count? No. Fuck. And you auto fail. Okay. So, um, what was I thinking of? Oh, yeah. So, nothing really happened, but you got, um, Jack just, I mean, King just starts running. Well, then. Where are you going, uh, coward? Shut up, for Christ. Snakes, Jeremiah, holy oh, shit! <laughs> so I like how Atlas is still enthralled, so she can't respond to them. <laughs> Atlas what? can't respond. I also, I also have realized that if I, um, when I once I unenthrall Atlas, technically I'm still floating eighty feet up in the air, and I'm dealing with a now kind of pissed off Atlas, and I feel like I'm going to be falling eighty feet. Very quickly, <laughs> at an alarming rate. Um. Jack so are you un? Are you un? Uh, enthralling her? No, I'm still enthralling her. Now I'm just going on about my life story, about my love, my one true love, Kevin Bacon. <laughs> okay. Uh, <laughs> because it's on while all the other agents go. Because the thing is, so. I still can't move or anything if I unenthrall if I unenthrall her. So, yeah, but she also can't move. So now we're just stuck because no one's gonna do anything. Except Jack will try something. All right. Yeah. There's Since there's uh, telephone around. poles, mm -hmm. Jack is gonna try to pinball himself off of those and try to grab. Her Fair warning: him. What you're planning, I can see what you're planning. What you're planning will break and fall. Yeah. Uh, mm -hmm. <laughs> I know, you know that, what? but they're, they're kind of stuck there right now. Unless... Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Honestly, it's not going to end until someone breaks and throw, and that's either when you attack Atlas or you attack me. <laughs> <laughs> Since Atlas is <laughs> enthralled, isn't she an auto hit? Or close what? To it? No, uh, she can yeah, still. Oh no, oh. she can still defend herself. So yeah. Yeah. But it will, to her detriment, uh, she will. Yeah. You'll have bonuses because she's enthralled. It'll be easier to hit her. So I'm going to do that pinball, but instead of catching uh, Freddy, Jack is going to try to deck her in the face. Atlas. Okay. Uh, CR8. Question, if he when... does this and it breaks the stasis, is Freddy about to fall <laughs> 80 feet? <laughs> Um, I don't well, know that if was my spaces because they just last up to I think ten minutes or a minute. But the thing is, though, so it's not I really a conversation. Oh, okay. If I use my action, which is hitting Atlas, I still have a lot of feet to move. Yeah. So I could theoretically try and catch you. But technically, you can't run on air. <laughs> you have no fly speed. Yeah, unless I try to pinball back, but I don't know if I can do that. That would be or an intellect least... check, which would be very hard. <laughs> exactly. So, yeah, CR8, can I use my speed to do this? Yes. So, Dex, I can bring that down by... 7, so... CR1. <laughs> no? Nice. Eight. 11. Nice. Got two ones. Double what you need. Alright, so... Woo! <laughs> Woo! Alright, you... Uh, just pinball, pinball up and sock uh, Atlas right in the face. And you... You see, you just like busted her lip a tiny bit. And she like looks back at you and looks back at Freddy... You talk way too goddamn much. Um, I need to go, but since you're up here already, uh, Atlas starts to fly off and take Freddy with her. 
Oh, <laughs> wow, that's great, guys. Um, hmm. Oh, great. Now you, fl you flitted too hard with the Atlas. No, I'm been in stuck in stasis this whole time. <laughs> How many rounds has it been since? I will say stasis is starting to fade, but again, <laughs> you're about a hundred feet up. <laughs> you want to? <laughs> you yes. want to stay in the bike or jump off? <laughs> I. I'll try. And would like to jump off. I love this bike to death, but I would like to jump off because I don't want. I do not want to go with this woman, who I have very much pissed off. Who does not like me? Who has the ability to make me completely freeze in place? <laughs> I, would I don't to... think there's a rule to this. To jump I off think the bike. there's just damage. Could I try to roll out of it so that I don't like so that like I can like land like in D and D basically, just like kind of roll out of it so that I don't have to like I don't take as much damage. Well, think of it like this: you're a hundred feet up. Oh, taking no, a straight just... vertical plummet. Okay, so you know what? Never mind. What I'm gonna do is I'm gonna enthrall her again. <laughs> You're going to enthrall her again. Yes. <laughs> you would have the... to make the same roll that you made before. <laughs> okay. What was that? That was a. Um... Stasis is still on. Oh, okay. Stasis is still on. Uh, I'm trying to think because, like, the problem is, okay. I am terrified to go with this woman. I do not want to go with her. <laughs> so I can either jump off the bike. Okay, question. If I jump off the bike, will it 100% kill me? Or will it just hurt a lot? Let me check the damage. Because if it does less than 30 damage, it's going to hurt a lot, but it's not going to kill me. <laughs> if it does 25 damage, your boy's dead. <laughs> Dante, I'm going to ask you this. Not even, like, for my own sake, not even for me or anything, but do you really want to kill a second character of JJ's in four sessions? I mean, I mean, I I, first one of is his choice. I yeah. take joy in killing your character when it's appropriate. I mean, I'd be fine with it. I, mean, I made the, the decision devil. to jump up this high. <laughs> I have plenty of backup characters in mind, all of which I think would be awesome to play. <laughs> Ah, the supervillain campaign, where JJ just keeps breeding in supervillains. <laughs> um, well, the thing is, Dante told me some information that I'm not going to share with you guys, but it's exciting to know about now, and that's all I'm going to say. <laughs> well, I feel like that's some bullshit right now, but okay. <laughs> Thomas had never seen such bullshit. <laughs> It has something to do with Jeremiah all right. knowing about Andre. That's all I'm going to say. So, I have found the damage. It's, it's not left. good. One point for every five feet. It's how many? One point for every five feet. And we're so up that's... 80 feet. I'm up 100 feet. I can't jump because otherwise I'm going to die. That would be 20 points of damage for you. It'd be 40 Three. points of damage for me? No, 20. Oh, 20 times me? 5 equals 100. Um, oh. So yeah, JJ, you'll, you'll, you'll still live when you fall. It's just gonna hurt. Um, so if I jump, I'm not gonna die. Oh wait, no, I read it wrong. One point oh. every 10 feet. So it's oh, 10 okay. points of damage for you. And... 8, yeah, eight points of damage for, for Jay. Okay. <laughs> Um, I'm going to jump off the bike. <laughs> this is going to hurt a lot. <laughs> Yo, but I'm not going to... How fast does a person fall? <laughs> um, it's, uh, it's something like something per second per second. 9.8 9 meters per second per second, second, but that's terminal velocity. You do not reach terminal velocity in 100 feet. <laughs> oh, um, let's Google search this. How fast does a person fall? How well, long does it take? It takes about square. two point... It takes about 2.5 seconds before they hit the ground if a human was to jump 100 feet above ground level. So well, I know it's going to take 2.5 seconds for me to hit the ground. <laughs> so then you would have reached um, terminal velocity. My question is, can she react fast enough to put you in stasis? GM and Chosen says that she can. Dante, I love you. 
but I'm really considering hitting you when I see you next week. If I see you next weekend. I'll be honest. I have I'm to do really... at least one GM intrusion. You didn't session. do a GM intrusion last session. <laughs> that means I'm a bad DM. <laughs> have an XP. You desperately need it. No, I'd rather not I take the like... XP because I'm angry. <laughs> well, you have this like is some XP. bullshit. How about sub Jack in for Freddy? It would make more sense because Jack just socked Atlas in the face. Fine. Jack shall be subbed in. I truth. I truth. It doesn't matter who's getting grabbed. Someone's getting grabbed. <laughs> so just take Jack. All right, Jack gets grabbed. I'm falling on you guys. Take the 10 points of damage. I'm not debilitated or impaired. But you are bruised, <laughs> and it hurts. That's gonna hurt in the morning. Can I enthrall the, her again? No, she's far too far away. Technically, it's not. It doesn't have a. It doesn't have a limit. How? Enthrall? The limit is how far they can hear you. I don't think you can yell. Dante. A hundred feet up and like thirty feet out. Dante, check the chat. Right I think your Discord. I think you're really, really okay. You know what? Fine. Um, <laughs> I'm gonna shoot her instead. <laughs> I pull on my pistol and just fire a bullet at her. Both killers are dead. At risk of hitting. I'm not gonna hit him. I don't think. <laughs> I don't think. <laughs> I don't think. Who do you give your XP to? JJ or me? Cause. Me, because you. Oh, yeah. No, I meant JJ. You. <laughs> I, was gonna, I was gonna say. <laughs> yeah, I'm giving it to Tats. Oh, thank you. <laughs> All right. So, Jack, you get flown above the mountains across. No, I was still LA. shooting her. Let me fire Your one, one bullet. bullet will not hit. All right, fire the bullet. Okay, what's the CR? <laughs> CR1. <laughs> oh, I'll be well, CR1, I have a pistol that lowers the difficulty by one, so I auto-hit. Alright, you hit her, her armor absorbs the damage. <laughs> I'm angry. <laughs> <laughs> um, because I, you don't have, you don't have single attack, right? No, I don't have single attack. Yeah, don't her armor absorbs the damage. Or rapid fart. <laughs> I don't have rapid fire. I'm using a pistol. <laughs> a pistol. So now Jack has been taken. Wait. Jack, you get flown above LA, past the mountains, and into the desert. Into where Burning Man once was. What's strange about that is that around this time, it's been like a week or two since Burning Man, it would have had all of the tents down. And stuff like that. There's still tents. There's smoke. Like fire smoke. And there's, from this high up, little green dots moving around Burning Man. Oh no. You see as you move closer and closer, these orcs that you haven't really seen before, um, so these green monstrosities that you have only seen in fantasy like books and stuff like that, or fantasy games, have formed a settlement in the middle of the desert. What <laughs> Like I said Purple pr purple lady, you seen this? Uh she looks over at you and goes, Yes, I'm seeing it. This is where, well, not you specifically, but this is where your friends got their powers from a portal that opened up here. They never closed. They never did anything about these monstrosities that came from here. So now they sit here. They sit here and grow in numbers and seem to show aggression to us. Well, that's not good. Why don't you guys stop them? You guys seem like you're more than capable of taking them. Because we don't know why they're here. What? 
don't really know what to say right now. I mean, pretty much. Gonna I just go wanted to show you that while you guys are having fun blowing up orphanages, robbing what? banks, killing innocent people, this is what's happening. This is what you can help prevent. But no. Choose to hurt the people that care for you. Choose to kill the people that stand aside and wish to help their community. Where are those people where my parents were killed, where I was on the for years? No one helped me. I had to fend for myself. I eventually worked my ass off until I could get a scholarship, go to a school, have a life. Finally all working now, and then I get this. I try to just... And all of a sudden, just go right back into that old habit. I don't know but why. you can make it good. You only make it bad habits because of the people you're around. This, this group that we are, we're here for good. We're here to help out. You could join us. Maybe you have a point. Maybe if I could just, like, have anyone to act, give me a guy. I don't know, but I'll Listen, see if I can ever be forgiven. I am going to let you free against my own better judgment. And you think about it. Think about the good that you can do instead of murdering. So, just, I'm not going to help you clear up your wanted criminal, criminal history. You're going to have to fix that yourself. I better not catch you doing anything bad again or I will not be kind a second time. Now, I have much more important things to deal with than some people who accidentally were in the right place at the wrong time. Now, please, for the love of God, tell your friends I do not want to see their faces again unless it's them begging for forgiveness. Because right now, I'm trying to stop an apocalypse. Now, can you leave. take me with you? And you, please, put, please. you, it's too late. You poof back to where you were, <laughs> um, when you fell. Well, wait, so he's like right in front of us that? now? Yeah, nah, man, I'm dude, I know this, you're bro. like have super speed and shit, but what the fuck? Nah, I don't want to hear it. I made some poor choices so far. I don't know if I should be seeing you guys anymore. <laughs> as as Jack just starts shaking his head to finish his sentence, he super speeds away. Wait, no, I was gonna talk to him. <laughs> Freddie was literally in the middle about to say your name. <laughs> like, Ooh. can I enthrall Jack? Technically, yes. I enthrall Jack. Jack, you can't move. <laughs> but this time, like, it's not just, like, random nonsense. It's Freddy actually, like, saying, like, talking. He's like, Jack, listen. I don't know what that woman said. I don't know what she showed you. I don't know. I don't know anything that happened. But think about everything that has happened to you. Think about everything that this city has done to all of us. They killed our fr they killed our friends. They took things from us, and now we're here. I feel like this is just everything we have done is justice for all of the bullshit they've done uh, for everything that they have pulled against us. Yes, the orphanage was something that happened, but you know what? We didn't want that. Wildfire didn't fill us in, and next time we'll make sh if we work with Wildfire again, we'll make sure he fills us in because we don't hurt kids. That's a big thing. All of us were kids at one point. I don't know. I, am... I just threw away my whole future trying to get revenge. And now I'm getting a chance to actually start over by that woman. And I think I might just have to take it. Why start over with something that, for something that you're having to change yourself when you can keep doing what you're Sorry. doing? Because I what? want to change myself. I was on the right path. I got this power, and I fell right back into who I was. And I don't want that to happen. So if you can please just leave me, let me go back. 
I really wish I had the one fucking perk I didn't want to fucking take. Ah! I'm not gonna force you to stay here. Thank you. But I have to say that if <laughs> sorry, um, sorry to interrupt. I forgot I was on push and talk. I said if you still want to take this. Sorry, I'm still. I forgot I was on push and talk. I said if you want to take that skill, still skill, oh. still you can. I'm not gonna take it right now because that's that's metagaming right now. <laughs> if I take it right now to use okay. it in this scenario, I'd feel bad. Okay, I understand that. <laughs> <laughs> Jack, I'm not gonna stop you from leaving. And after I'm done talking, I'll drop and throw. You can do whatever you want. But if you are gonna be working with this woman. And I do see you again. We're going to be on opposite sides of this battle. And I won't stop a second. And I won't hesitate. Same here. And with that, he drops his ball. Jack does a two-finger salute. And just vanishes. Bolt flash around. And with that, JJ has saved me from making another god-awful hero. <laughs> by adding one to my reservoir. Honestly, and? Freddy is kind of hurt right now. <laughs> we were supposedly That's a power right. couple. <laughs> Thought you were Faye. Turns out you're just fam. Fam. <laughs> but with that, I'd say the session's over. <laughs> Oh. And JJ, start making character number three. <laughs> JJ is on character number three now. <laughs> this one I, I had ultimate. no a part of. This one, this one was all him. Wait, so then what happened with me with the fucking things that crawled over us? Oh, That's what happens when you try to make a anti-hero a villain? It just doesn't work. <laughs> Joker could easily Jack... become a villain. Yeah. <laughs> what do I you see mean? Jack possibly coming back into villainy from one like one thing happening, one bad thing happening. But for now, um, I assume you want Jack to like go to the police station, talk to Tiffany, and stuff like that. Yes. Then yeah, you're giving forfeit your character, and you gotta make a new one. Yep. Erasing the sheet I... right now. I'll say this right now. I am so happy that I didn't tell them about the base. <laughs> because if we <laughs> if I had told them about the base, we'd need a new fucking base because Jack would know where our base is. True. But now Freddy's just hurt. Dante, I, have a, I have a character in mind already. I have and to do that? something. It is oh, okay. uses blazing with radiance. Oh your laser character. <laughs> And then there was three again. No, we don't even. We don't even. Oh wait, I was gonna say we don't even have three, but we have Charles. XP, 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 XP. XP everyone gets four. XP. Everyone gets six. I like. I have seven XP. Six XP. Because I want you guys to have backup XP. <laughs> Jokes on you. I'm gonna spend it all right now. And not get thrown at. CR 8 or 10 characters. No, that's still gonna happen. You guys chose villains, and you guys knew your, knew your allies when you guys were heroes. You guys knew this was gonna come. <laughs> yeah, maybe. Possibly. 